Every year we get a new crop of cocky, headstrong recruits who think they know everything. Sure, you guys have demonstrated some raw talent, but at this institution, we're looking for someone who's not afraid to get their hands dirty. We're looking for someone who can rise to the occasion. We aren't interested in dealing with any half-baked, bad seeds. We're looking for the best of the best. Gentlemen, welcome to Top One. Maverick, let's see what you've got. Put on your uniform and make me a top bun. And just to make it a little bit more challenging, you won't be able to get any help from that friend of yours, Goose. My way to the bigger zone Rising dough in the bigger zone <gasps> What is this? Enriched white bread? Are you trying to give me diabetes? Let me draw you a picture, Maverick. This is a whole wheat berry. It contains three layers. An outer bran layer, which is the fiber, a germ cell layer, which has valuable vitamin B complexes, and a starchy endosperm. When you take a whole wheat berry and then you process it into a fine flour, you take out the germ layer, and then you have to artificially enrich it with the very nutrients you took out through processing. Furthermore, when you process it and take out the bran layer, you lose the fiber. This results in a starchy endosperm that is highly absorbable. This results in harmful elevations in blood sugar levels. Enriched white bread is not a top bun. You're going to need to try again, Maverick. I way to the bigger zone Rising dough in the bigger zone what is this? Multi-grain bread? A bread made up of multiple refined grains is still highly processed and highly absorbable, no matter how many grains it's made out of. Maverick, you're gonna have to do better than that! I way to the baker zone Rising dough in the baker zone What's this supposed to be? 100% whole wheat bread? You think you're a real hot shot, Maverick, don't you? People sure love their 100% whole wheat, but this isn't what they mean. Ice! Show Maverick what they mean by 100% whole wheat. Yes, Maverick, this is what people mean by 100% whole wheat bread. And while bread made out of 100% whole wheat flour does contain all parts of the whole wheat berry, the fiber is so highly processed that it does not effectively delay the absorption of the starch. The problem is particle size. Back in the day, we used to make bread out of coarsely ground flour. Now, machine rollers process the fiber to such a great extent and to such a small particle size that the starch is rapidly absorbed. What are you doing there? Making a sourdough starter for sourdough bread? Now you're getting somewhere, Maverick. Sourdough takes advantage of natural bacterial spores, which ferments the natural sugars in the bread into lactic acid. That lactic acid not only flavors sourdough bread, but it also changes the chemical environment to significantly delay the absorption of the starch. Maverick, this sourdough bread deserves an honorable mention, but it is still not the top bun. What's this now? You're making bread from sprouted grains? Now you're talking, Maverick. Sprouted grain bread is the ultimate bread because it's made up of the whole wheat berries instead of ground flour. Let's take a look at how you made this sprouted bread. Congratulations, Maverick. Despite your cocky attitude, you've successfully baked a top bun. Now, sit back, relax, and enjoy a slice of bread. Boom. Bo boom. Bo boom. Bo boom. 
Watching in slow motion, eating every slice of bread. What's all the commotion with this hearty slice of bread? I'll take my bread this way. I'll take my bread this way.